Welcome, welcome, welcome. Hello, I'm your host, Mrs. M. And if you haven't, make sure you click the link below. That way you can subscribe to my channel and receive everything you need to scale your cleaning business to six figures and beyond. Wow, hello there. So I'm gonna talk today uh, kind of like a follow-up from the video that we did yes or that I did yesterday on talking about how are you going to capture and actually move towards you your ideal cleaning customer, your prospect. So yesterday I spoke about working for it, working to get your ideal customer towards you. So you're doing something on a regular basis. Remember, we're systematizing everything. So when you've got to go on vacation, you want your, your business to keep running like as if you're there. That's when you know you have an effective and an actual business, when you can take yourself out of it and it actually runs without you. Now, if you're able to do that, if you're able to, you know, make sure that you're still getting the customers, you still have a way to do inspections to make sure that your customers are happy, everything is running effortlessly without you. You have a system in place, SOP, standing operating procedures in place. So even if you want to work in your business, that's fine. But if something happens where you can't or you choose not to, that's where you want to make sure that everything can run without you. And so when it comes to marketing and getting customers, remember we've talked about the three pillars, the attraction, the customer acquisition, and the customer retention. A great deal. If you've looked at any of my videos, you know I'm a big proponent of those three. I believe those three actually make up the business. So what you want to look at is working for it, which was the blog, the blog post and doing all of those to get the business to come to you with the working for it. That means it's free. It's organic. This traffic has come to you through various ways, search engine, or it could be from blog posts, could be from the so social media, all of that combination. Now we're talking about the other part is paying for it. You are paying for the attention. You're paying for the customers. That means you're doing retargeting ads. You're doing YouTube videos, um, Google AdWords. All of this is you're paying for. I believe you should do a combination of both. There's four weeks in the month. Now it's not exactly four month, you know, four weeks even, um, but there's like four weeks generally, other than like basically the month or you know, 30 days, 31 days, other than when it comes to February. But you want to choose one day, let's say Wednesday, the first and the third Wednesday, you're going to do paid. The second and the fourth, you're going to do organic. Continue to work that and start to track. Matrix is so important. What's working and what's not. Pay close attention to what's working and what's not. So then you'll start to say, okay, I did five social media posts and it didn't even budge. I didn't even get a, mm, not even like a little boof. Then you know you've got to do nine. And then after you do nine, you start getting some traction. Then look and say, okay, I got, you know, 10 people to visit my website. I want to actually get 20. So if I did nine, I might need to do 20. You know, I'm just saying, you've got to put the effort in and you have to make sure you're consistent and persistent with it. So try yesterday's approach with the working for it and try today's approach with the paying for it. Mix the two together. Keep your matrix and see what is working. And as I always say, throw out what's not. So if you are interested in so much more, then make sure you sign up for the absolute free masterclass on the blueprint that I use to actually scale all three of my cleaning businesses where they were able to scale within a year and one of them was in a couple of weeks to get to 30K. So if you want to know that, how to get like 10 times more customers in 30 days, I am going to make sure that I spell it out for you, give you all my secrets. And what you need to do is to attend and bring a pen and paper. And every so often I update these because one thing about this business, when it comes to online marketing, it changes all the time. So if you attended it before, you might be surprised what's out there now. So make sure that you click the link to register. I'd love to see you actually there and looking forward to it. Okay? Okay. So until next time, be safe. Make sure you click and register and take care. Bye-bye.